Hey, it's Dry Bear. And today I bring you a bit of a PSA as there are some things to know about your legendaries in Diablo 4. And that is two of the legendaries that exist in the game right now, one that is for all classes and one that is for Barbarian only, have been disabled until the next content update. However, there's nothing in the UI showing this, which means that if you have the gear on, you'll still get the stats, but the legendary isn't working anymore. So if you've noticed that your damage has gone down over the weekend, this might be why. But first, you should come hang out with me on my live stream. I'm live every single day on twitch.tv forward slash drybear. If you don't come hang out with me in my community, the next time you enter into a cellar in Diablo 4, it won't be a treasure goblin cellar. All right, let's get into it. There are two legendary powers that have been shown to be problematic. They have either some kind of calculation that's existing on the back end that we don't see, that has some runaway values that are becoming very problematic and uh, have been disabled. Typically, Things like this get disabled in a live game because it is causing issues that are game breaking, but pushing out a content update is too risky or too unstable or they're unprepared to do so. And so they just disable it in the short term so that they don't have problems and then they can get to it when the next thing happens, which tells me that what's going on with these legendaries is not just a value. There's something content wise, the code itself, the functionality, something going on with it it is problematic. The first legendary that you need to know about is Edgemaster's Aspect. What this one does is that skills deal bonus damage up to 20% for uh, regular uh, items, and it can be put onto your weapon, two-hander, and your amulet as well. Uh, when they have higher amounts of primary resource, mana, fury, essence, spirit, doesn't matter, you will receive bonus damage based on how much primary resource you have. This has been disabled as of two days ago. Uh, they didn't note exactly why, but something tells me that you can stack maximum a resource and you can cause this to go much bigger than intended or potentially with some resource back. Some calculations are just poorly timed and there's some issues with this going on. So if you have Edge Master's Aspect on one of your pieces of gear, if it shows up on that piece, it will still give you stats and it'll still show up as if it works. For example, I have these gloves with Edge Masters on it. It has the max roll. You put it here and it's going to show that it does work. If I put this on, it's not grayed out. It doesn't say that anything's wrong with it. And that's because there is a content change required for them to show that. But this is actually disabled, which means you won't be getting this power spike. So if you're running Edge Masters in your build right now and you're wondering why you logged in over the, over the weekend and suddenly your damage was lower than you thought, it's because Edge Masters has been disabled and isn't working. Now, it's not a nerf per se. It possibly could be it, whatever issue they're having that they end up changing may make this worse than it is right now. Or maybe it's just a runaway situation where if you abuse certain mechanics, there's a problem. If they can fix that and there's no change to the uh, legendary, then we'll get this back probably with the next content update. But that's not the only one. Aspect of Berserk Ripping, a barbarian legendary that makes it so if you have the Berserking status active, any direct damage you deal will apply a bleed onto the target for a percentage of the damage. We recently saw the Echo of Lilith, the uber mega ultra end game optional boss get taken down by a barbarian and this one was part of the problem in that the, the amount of damage was being amplified overall because all of it was being converted into bleeding, and then that bleeding can be ripped out with rupture for execute. It's actually very similar to the, uh, the Blood God Barbarian that I had uh, theorized before, but it is something that is causing too much damage. So this one is actually disabled as well. If you're on Barbarian and you're running Berserk Ripping, the same thing goes. It'll show up on your gear, it'll look as if it's working, but it actually won't. So if your damage is lower, you may want to swap in different legendaries for Edge Masters or Berserk Ripping until these get reactivated. Uh, you guys come by my live stream, be happy to let you know when these get turned back. But usually if they're disabled for an issue and they can't be fixed without a content update, they won't be turned back on until the next content update, which hopefully should be soon. And that's what I got for you today. I want to make sure you guys were aware, wondering where your damage went. This is possibly one of the reasons why that went away. Thanks for hanging out. If you found value in the video, leave a like down below, leave a comment. It helps me with the algorithm, helps this video get seen by more people and come hang out with me on my live stream. I'd love to have you there. If you enjoyed yourself today, leave a like down below. You can support me and my work on Patreon and view Patreon exclusive content, link in the description. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you in the next one.